Okay, I did a gloomy on an island with only 11 people and swinging on a rope across a river to get to school every day. What if your pet is not a dog or a cat, but a real raccoon? My great grandpa has climbed to the top of a very famous pyramid and received an award for saving a man's life. I call my great grandpa Paul, and he is an amazing person. My grandpa is 72 years old, but he has a lot of energy and acts so young. He was born October 24, 1941. My, gran my great grandpa's name is Lester. It's a unique name. His mom made up, up because she was named after his uncle Sylvester. He comes from a big family like I do and has eight brothers and sisters. Growing up, he lived on a 19-anchor island called Oak Island in California. It only has one bridge to get off the island. Candy, bar candy bars were only five cents, soda pop, 10 cents, and milk, 29 cents. There was no TV, <laughs> only radio, and every night his family would all get together in the living room and hear scary stories on the radio. My grandpa had a pet raccoon named Fingers. <laughs> <laughs> Raccoons are very are usually very dangerous, but he found him as a baby. The raccoon mom was killed by a car, and he didn't want to be alone, all alone. One day, the raccoon got out and ran into his burger, kind of like Burger King, and was eating all the food and terrorizing people. The owner knew it was him, my grandpa's raccoon, because he was the only person in town to have a pet raccoon. Eventually, he gave fingers to the Oregon Zoo. He drove a tractor for his job and made 90 cents an hour. Right now, people make <coughs> um, $9.10 an hour. He only bought, brought on $7 every day after working 10 hours each day. He would go painting for gold after work and would sometimes find up to $30 in gold a day. My grandpa has so many accomplishments. He has climbed to the top of a very famous pyramid in Mexico called Chitza. You can't climb it anymore because the steps are wearing out. He also worked at the same job for 30 years at TriMet. Bus was a <coughs> bus. I mean, bus and was a super. Um, I think I don't know. Supervisor for Max Train. He has won safety awards for being an excellent bus and max train driver. He also received an award when he saved a man's life. He was driving the train at work. He did CPR until the ambulance arrived. The award was called the Gus Samaritan Award. He is also so good at bowling and has lots of bowling awards. My grandpa said that one of his best accomplishments is having my mom as his granddaughter. The activity my grandpa chose was bowling. We went to a bowling alley in Russian. We played a couple games for free. He owns a couple bowling balls. One was given to him because of an award he won. He had another one that he bought with his own money. 
the first round we played, I got a spare. A spare is when you get some of the pins in. On your second turn, you get all the rests. The entire time we were bowling, my grandpa got 11 strikes, and I got one. <laughs> my grandpa did this cool trick where the ball like it's going to go in the gutter but at last second it goes <coughs> in and gets a strike. I still want to know how he does that. I had a lot of fun with him and learning some new things. I love Bot and he always makes me smile because of all the cool things he shows me. I interviewed my grandpa on a video, and here's him, here's one I draw and colored, and here's some bowling stuff, and it looks like a tomato, a tomato, because it's more of an oval shape, and I've got Second, I just went in here and then we went. 